Here we have a PNY 4090 video card that came in for a melted connector. Just because I'm not posting repairs on melted connectors every day does not mean that we're not getting the cards every single day. This one is PNY 4090 24 gigs and void warranty void if removed. So you have to be careful. If that label is removed, PNY is going to void your warranty. I'm scared. I want my mommy. Like PNY is going to honor any warranties if something went wrong with that card. Right? Let's not go there in this video and focus on that connector. The connector is most definitely burnt. We do not know how that connector burnt. The customer did not mention anything about any adapters, cable mod adapters or 90 degree adapters, but he did leave a six word sentence. The 12th pin on my 4090 melted. That's good enough for me. He does not need to write an essay on how it happened. Straight to the point. I like it. That customer deserves a medal. Short, sweet, and straight to the point. So without wasting any time, let's make it short and sweet. We're going to remove the connector, solder another one, invoice, and mail the card back to the customer. Easy. That's the first repair for the day. And we have a lot more to cover today. So let's get this out of the way. Fume extractor on, my hot air station on. And let's do it. So I'm going to preheat the board because that's one thick board. 12 to 15 layers. I do not know how many layers that board has and I do not care, but I know it's a thick board. Because maybe I mentioned the board is 12 layers and you have a scientist in the comments, no, it's 13 layers. Do I look like I care if it's 12 or 13 or 15 or 20 or 60? I just want to replace the connector and we're done. The reason I mentioned 12 to 15 layers is so that you know the board is thick. It takes a lot of heat, a lot of thermal mass. Whenever I'm working on two, three cars at the same time, I wear a mask because the smell cannot be good. I do have the purifier on, a big purifier that can handle 2,800 square feet. And I'm in a, what, three, 400 square feet room. So it's big enough for this room. And I have the fume extractor on, but that smell still escapes. What can you do? We are using low melt solder because low melt solder is magic. If we try to desolder that connector without low melt, it's going to take an extreme amount of heat because the board has to absorb all the heat and it has to reach melting temperature of solder before we are able to remove that connector. Now PNY boards are weak on the masking that they have. So you may see scratches on the board after I'm done. But that's okay. We'll cover it. And back like new. Or better than factory. Whichever one you want. Some viewers, they write, how can it be better than factory? Well, factory broke, right? And we fixed it, right? So it's better than factory. 
That's the way I look at it. Okay, so those pins are already moving. We did not stress out the board from heat. We applied low melt. And now I'm gonna grab the connector with my bent nose pliers and all the tools that we are using for this repair you can buy directly off our site. Just log into northwishfix.com, click on shop, add to cart, check out pay, and we almost always ship out same day. We have everything from this amazing microscope, the Northwish Fix microscope, articulating arm, hot air station, soldering station, the flux, low melt solder, solder sucker, like the one that we're gonna be using now to suck solder off the holes. I cannot show it to you under the microscope because it's tall. It does not fit under the microscope but I'll show you the results. All right, let's check the holes. Amazing, amazing. We're gonna grab a new connector. Uh, we're gonna place that connector right here. Yeah. Yeah, 60 زيادة. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. تمام. I do not know what's going on with shipping to Canada, but we have a couple of orders to Canada, and shipping is almost twice as much. The customer placed an order for $2,000. I mean, that order is heavy. So the shipping rate was about $140. But another order came in right now, $480, and shipping is like Just making sure all the pins are in. Very good. Apply flux. A river of flux. anti glare light so we get rid of the reflections and amazing no reflections you cannot even see that we have flux on the board look at the difference from this where we can barely see the pins because of the reflections from flux to using the northridge fix anti glare light where the image will look like this what more do you want tell me that's not magic
Amazing. We did an amazing job. We have one tiny scratch on the top. Let's cover it. We do not have to. But we want to make this better than factory. So this is the Northridge Fix UV light. UV light. UV mask. And we have it in green, red, blue, and black. So what we're going to do is apply a tiny bit on this spudger, just like that. I mean, I applied a lot. We're not going to use all that. A tiny bit goes a long way. You can cover half the board with a tiny bit. Not half the board, but almost. Look, just the tip of my tweezer. And we're done. We do not have any more scratches. So let's put this on the side for the next video card. We're going to apply UV light. And I just want you to see how fast that UV cures. I'm using UV light and hot air. I did mention the trick with hot air a while back in a separate video. You can go ahead and watch it. So right now we are watching UV cure in real time. No fast forward. Awesome job. All right, and we are done. I'm going to hand the card over to Big Boss so he can reassemble and test. Invoice and mail it back to the customer. Surprise, surprise. We have another... 4090 with a melted connector. This one has the cable mod adapter connected to it, and it just molded itself to that connector. Expedited service, so we're going to be doing this one maybe today or tomorrow. But just to show you, the 4090 melted connectors are not over. We still get them every single day. I hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know what you think. Leave it down in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll do something else in the next video.